Hey y'all, what's up and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jordan Simone, if you don't know. If you do, hey and welcome back. Um, ignore my background and ignore this stain on my shirt. I did it when I was trying to put it on and change shirts. But um, today I'm going to be showing you guys basically how I install this wig really fast. Um, I'm kind of going to speed through that because it's just free spray and stuff. But basically how I lay my baby hairs. Um, it's not really a tutorial but kind of a tutorial. If y'all want a more in-depth video on that, on a wig that I haven't already constructed the baby hairs, let me know. Um, but yeah, this hair is from Original Queen Hair. It is their, I think it is Silky Straight in 26 inches i don't know um the hair stops about right here and i did cut an inch or two off um just to make it a little bit more straight but yeah y'all i'm in love with this hair it's so cute but anyways um if y'all want to see how i maintain my baby hairs or how i just fix them up or do them it's not exactly doing them from scratch but you know it is what it is i'll make another video on that if y'all want me to but yeah, let's get started. Also, one more thing. I recorded this video two days ago. So this next clip is going to be me looking different because um, I finished it and I'm recording the intro on day three. So I'll probably speak on that a little bit in the middle. But um, yeah, like I said, let's start the video. The first thing I'm gonna do is just do the simple ones and twos -y, like do the free spray, put it on, and then I will like fast forward through this since y'all already know. Basically, I'm just gonna take it, put the free spray on it, lay it down like that, you know, adjust it to my head. Yada, 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 just like that. Boom, you're done with that. And then I'll show you the big hair because there's no point in showing me, showing y'all this when I've already done everything I need to do to it. Like, that's just a stupid video. And I feel like y'all be like, Jordan, why are you even here? Anyways, so yeah, I'm just gonna do that and then I'll be back when it's time to cut and style my baby hair. Sorry, on my phone, I had to do that other video. And I just bought a laptop. I don't know why I'm not using it, but I'm not. Because it doesn't, like, let me put my videos on my phone on there. So I have to figure that out. But, yeah. Thank you. 
for the baby hair we're just gonna focus on this part right here because um it was too big for my head and i accidentally shifted it too far and this side is like too long like it's too far down that's why we made it into a side part you know the um is it innovative no um i don't know but be smart don't play yourself and do a middle part because it's not gonna look right but um i'm gonna do a side part all right guys so now i'm going to separate out the hair that i need um this is my mirror right here and i keep moving so i really don't know where i'm going with this um basically i'm just gonna part out the hairs that i need which is a very very thin row But um, yeah, we're not gonna mess with that side because it is like extremely long. So um, we're just gonna do like this. Bam. Now we're gonna work with this. Um. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to tweeze it. Now I'm going to thin it out as much as possible without balding it. I'm going to try my best. It hasn't plucked in a while and I don't really remember how to do it. But that should be fine. And my mirror is like all the way over here. And also be careful to not um, pull your hair since this is so close to your edges. Please be careful of that because you don't want to pull your edges out. And it's not like you won't feel it. You'll freaking feel it. But it's not a pleasant feeling either. So try to avoid doing that. Thin them out. I feel like I thin them out enough. I probably should thin them out a little bit more, but we'll see what it looks like in a second. Now I'm gonna thin these ones out over here. I'm just gonna do the same thing with this side with the wax stick. I can't ignore this side. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take my eyebrow razor. This is a dull one. I just bought a new one, but it's all going to the bathroom when I was like picking it. So I'm just going to cut it in like a waterfall. I'm just gonna cut them like this. Just like that. And 
and leave it like that for a second and then get this side and do it the same way you want to cut them like an inch long everyone says i don't really know how long an inch is but i'm assuming that's an inch um Cut the same thing over here. Like I said before, this one is dull, so it doesn't cut as well. Um, so yeah, we're looking like porcupine right now. I just earned a bueno. But now what we're gonna do, the fun part, is we're gonna get our mousse. Alright guys, this is the most fun part and the most frustrating part at the same time. Because if this stuff dries up, you gotta keep putting it on there. But the main objective of this is to try to get it done as fast as possible and work as fast as possible. Um, because the longer you do it, the more it like the wig, the more um likely it is for the wig to lift, especially with free spray. I don't know about with like waterproof glues and stuff like that, but with free spray, it sometimes goes on. Yeah, you might want to move a little fast. So basically, I'm just going to spray it. Oh my gosh, this part is just like irking me. Um, I'm basically gonna just spray it. I'm saying spray. Um, put it on there, foam, and I'm just going to work with it while it's like setting in the foam. You don't want to like put a little bit of foam. It needs to be a generous amount of foam. I know you, it's like hard to see sometimes, but it helps the baby hairs like lay flat. Like it helps weigh it down. Cause as you see right now, like they're just kind of sticking up, but the weight of this, it like pushes it down so that when you lay it down and move around and stuff, it's not gonna keep coming up like this. So let's get started with this. Cause I feel that I'm gonna mess this up, but it's okay. Cause I don't really know what kind of look I'm going for with these baby hairs. But we will figure it out. So I'm gonna put a little bit more of the wax stick up here. I just put a little bit more of the wax stick up there. And you just wanna get either like a small tooth comb or an edge brush. Either one is fine. Gonna get started. And you just want to kind of push it on there a little bit. Just gonna do this side first, and we're just gonna start swooping very, very lightly. Sorry if you got makeup on. I know my makeup's about to be jacked after this, but that's okay. Maybe I'll be doing that face, right? Okay, we'll fix that up later because this needs to be shorter. But we're just gonna get the other side real fast. You see how fast I'm working? Like you have to work this fast or that mess is going to lift. This baby hair is way too long. Um, sorry, I'm trying something new. So this is way too long, but we'll cut that in a second. Well, I cut it now, so I don't need to. I basically just cut it in a diagonal.
now I'm gonna put an elastic band over my head if I can find it. Oh my god, okay, you guys. I found it, it was in the bathroom. Um, basically, just tie this flat on your head and let it sit while you're styling the wig. But, of course, my wig's already styled. So, you just wanna touch it up a little bit and don't do this while you have makeup on because that's gross. I planned it before this video, so I'm just gonna show you what it looks like right now. I would think that'd be the smartest thing to do. So I look sad. Um, I had two burgers, but this is what the wig looks like. Very silky, very smooth, very silky, very smooth. This is from Original Queen Hair. I had the box in the last video, but. I really lost it, so I don't have it right now. But yeah, look at this. What? Oh wait. Yeah, this was, I think it was 26 inches or 24, I think it was 26. But um, I cut an inch off of it. It stops about right here. I cut an inch off of it because I just felt like it would look a little bit more sleek if I did it that way. Um, you know, the like straight cut. It's not really a straight cut, but kind of. Um, but yeah, I like it a lot better this way. Um, this is their straight. I think it's Brazilian straight. Um, I think it's regular lace. I think it's medium Swiss lace. I'll put everything about it down below in the description box. Um, but yeah, y'all should go check this out. Um, yeah, so basically, I'm up here BSing for no reason, um, because I'm clearly not going to put anything in because I don't want it to get all, like, staticky. So, I'll see y'all when this is done drying so that I can show y'all how I pick it apart, basically, and make it look more realistic and fix what I messed up. But yeah, I will see y'all then. Hey y'all, so <clears throat> y'all know how I said I was going to be back to show y'all my video. Well, laziness at, you know my wig head, laziness at its finest because it's two days later, two or three days later, and I'm just now finishing this video, but, um, you know, I'm still going to show y'all how to like fix your edges, etc, etc, but, um, I've just been going through a lot of things and, but we back and we better now. I had to clear some stuff up, but, um, but yeah, anyways, y'all, we're back and we're better, and, um, I'm going to be showing y'all how to fix baby hair, so I'm going to take this thing off my head, disclaimer, I don't know what it's looking like right now, but we're going to fix it regardless, so, I'm just going to take this thing off, okay, alright, so boom, it's off now. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our comb or edge brush, whatever you have, and we're just going to brush it out so it doesn't look all stuck on our head. You wanna make it a little bit messier. Um, it's probably not gonna get as messy, but um, you wanna just try to make it a little bit more messy. Um, I think I had glued one of these down incorrectly. So it's like not as great. Okay, now I'm gonna get this side. This side is a little long for these baby hairs, but I might cut them, I might not. I might just freak it, make it look decent. Maybe cut this one piece of lace off because it's too much. Um, so I'll be right back when I do that. Okay, guys, so I cut that extra piece off. I'm gonna grab my nose ring. And I'm just going to separate that because that hair was in the wrong place. Yeah, like that. You'd be like, like so. So, like so. Um, but that is pretty much it for that. Now, another thing you can do is if you got that spray stuff, you can and spray that um i should probably do that 
but I'm actually kind of liking this thing that's going on right now and I don't want to mess it up with makeup because I'm really bad with makeup on hair I smear it all the time so I'm kind of happy with this look um this baby here could be cut a bit shorter or not as much as needed um that over there but you know that probably won't want to work with me but it's okay but yeah that's pretty much the final look again this hair is from original clean hair stops about right here i did cut an inch off um I did cut an inch off, um, but it's still pretty long. It's 26 inches, I think, or 24. I'll put everything down below about it in the description box. Um, what else can I cover? Yeah, pretty much that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what else y'all want to see. Um, I should be a little bit more consistent. I got a few more videos up and running for you guys that I'm looking to get uploaded soon. I'm um, not going to give y'all a date because I'm not good with that. But... Okay, make sure to follow me on my TikTok, Instagram, and Snapchat, and I will catch y'all on the next one. Bye.